Ooh. Is the animosity between you two gone now that you've got the victory? You've proven that you're better than him in the Ox gone. Is it over for you, or are you always going to have that between you? Uh, you know, it's it's always we're always going to be divided. You know, he stands for everything I hate. He stands for evil. He stands for Black Lives Matter. You know, I stand for America. I stand for dedicating this victory to all the law enforcement out there, all all the military, all the people that put their lives on the line every day to protect our freedoms and, and to keep our communities safe. So, you know, he doesn't stand up for that stuff. He he hates that. He wants to defund the police. You know, and it's it's a shame. So I'll never be friends with a guy like that. Well, I guess with your other posts, you called. Tyron Woodley, a domestic terrorist sympathizer. How, how do you draw that parallel to, um, you know, fighting for equal rights and social justice? How are those the same? Because he's standing up for lifelong criminals. You know, the Black Lives Matter is, is a complete sham. It's a joke. They're, they're, they're taking these people that are complete terrorists. You know, they're taking these people that are criminals. You know, these aren't people that are hardworking Americans, blue collar Americans. These are bad people that are criminals, you know, and they shouldn't be attacking police, you know. If, you, if, if you're breaking the law and you're, you're threatening the cops with weapons, you, you know, you deserve to get what you get. So, you know, that, the law enforcement, you know, is, protects us all. You know, if we don't have law enforcement, it'd be the wild, wild west. So, you know, people need to go give a pat on the back to law enforcement every single day and thank them for, for keeping us all safe. Other, otherwise, you know, all these criminals will be running the streets wild and none of us will be safe. So you're saying that Tyron Woodley supports criminal behavior and encourages it? Yeah, absolutely. You know, he's, he's a communist. You know, he's a Marxist. You know, he stands for, for criminals. You know, he, he, he hates America. And that's why he got broke tonight. Understood. Um, what makes him a communist? I don't understand how you arrived at that conclusion that he's a communist. Mm -hmm. Because everything that he stands for, man, he's just, he stands for everything that is against America. He doesn't like America. He doesn't stand up for the rights of America. He doesn't stand up for law enforcement officers. He wants to defund the police. These are the same police that give him private security and him and his family, you know, daily. So, you know, now you want to vilify them and put targets on their back like LeBron James. You know, these guys are heroes, man. These guys are real celebrities. So, you know, we need to give a shout to law enforcement and stop trying to vilify them.